Today we say goodbye to the most delicious subscription box there is. Let's get to it. Hey guys, thanks for joining us. So this is it, the farewell tour. Yes. Fantastic cakes. It's been a delicious little journey we've had with him. Uh, completely delicious. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is it though. If you want to get in yours, I believe January 10th is the cutoff date. Yes. That's when he will no longer be taking orders past that. So try it out. It's, it's, we really liked it. It's been a really delicious. He does send this, us this box for free. So yeah. tremendous thank you to Ken. Yeah, this Let's one has definitely been one of my favorites because um, I do like cake and there's lots of cookies I like. Who doesn't like cake? <laughs> All right, Sabrina, how much are they? they For are the last time. $40. Sorry, I didn't get anything in your milk. There. Thank you. <laughs> so they are $40, of course. Okay. All right. I, I have not peeked. I don't know what we yeah, have Yeah, I have no clue what's one. in there. Curious to see what he's going to send us out with. Yes. Kind of it's excited. Like, this one's awesome. All right, here you go. Oh. Uh, oh, there he's talking about how he's going to be deactivated. Oh, January 5th. January 5th. Okay. So final orders will be on January 4th. And through the Facebook page. Oh, if you do it through the Facebook page, you can go till January 10th. That's his website is ending Jan January 4th. Okay. okay. Uh, he has a new until the end plan. Is now available and take a subscriber to the end of service in May. Okay, so definitely check out his website, check out his Facebook and all that stuff. I'll have all those links, of course, down in the video description for you. All right, uh, it sounds real good. <laughs> I'm sending <laughs> this out on a high like, note. Colorful. Obviously, we're a little late for Christmas. Uh, yes, we are. We were Sorry spending time with family and the we kids were. and stuff like that, so our filming schedule got way off. Yes, uh, it so, did. So we've got this, though. Cake in a cup, vanilla with buttercream. It was kind of like that last time. I just didn't yeah. have the fancy colors, and it was dynamite. <laughs> I loved it. Yes. I and loved his it. His icing is actually pretty good, especially since I don't like icing. So then we've got... Gingerbread cake pops. I okay, love gingerbread. Okay, I am curious about yep. trying those. Yep, 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 yep. Then we've got Christmas sugar cookies. Christmas sugar cookies. You I mean, can't go it, wrong with it, that. Exactly. And then we have... What are brownies? Uh, those are triple layer cookie bars. Triple layer cookie bars. He has to say that all items are created in a kitchen that uses nuts, dairy, eggs, soy, and other allergens. Please read the entire list. So he gives you the entire list here of what's in everything. So that's flour, sugar, brown sugar, cocoa powder, salt, baking soda, baking powder, butter, vegetable oil, eggs, chocolate chips, and Oreo cookies are in there. So it's probably like half chocolate chip, half Oreo. Well, it looks like a brownie though. All right. This is going to be delicious. Uh... All right, we're going to take some pictures of this delicious food so you can see what we're eating up close. Hold on. Be right back. All right, pictures are taken. Uh, as always, the smells right now are amazing. All right, how about we go down the list? Cake okay. in a cup, vanilla with buttercream icing. Okay. That's some first? Yeah, okay. just go right down the list. Uh, seriously, I think he had something like it. It just wasn't the different colors. Yep. I really liked it last month, so I'm kind of excited for this. Okay. Like, he's got a really thing, big thing of icing there, so I gotta... Oh, I didn't get to that. That's all right. I'm like, oh. see if I can get a little. You ready? Mm -hmm. mm. I'm going to get that second layer of icing. His icing is always spot on. Always. I'm going to miss that icing. <laughs> I am mm. too. Ken, you mm -hmm. just want to send us a cake whenever you feel like it. You've got our address. <laughs> that was a good one. Yeah, mm, that's good. Yeah. All, oh. right. So, All right. You need to cleanse the palate. Uh, Christmas is over, but we're still getting to enjoy the flavors know, right? of Christmas. <laughs> Deliciousness. Got some cake here. All right. Okay. Uh, so next is the gingerbread cake pops. I'm a huge gingerbread person. I am too. And I'm a huge cake pop person, which you're not. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm going to smack our balls together. Do it in front of the mic so they can hear it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop hitting my ball. 
Mm. Like, if you like gingerbread. Yeah. It's like a soft gingerbread cookie. The flavor is amazing. Yeah. I like the texture because... Not to mention it looks like a big round of poo, but... <laughs> It looks freaking amazing. <laughs> it's why the, amazing. The white is on the outside there, so you don't see that poop on the inside. But literally, like it's mm. like the perfect flavor of a gingerbread cookie. Like that's awesome. There's the gingerbread. It's so snaps. good. I'm going back into another bite. I don't know that. She doesn't do that. There's the gingerbread snaps, and I really like the taste gingerbread, but I don't really like those because I don't like the snap, the crunch. Mm, I like those. I like the soft gingerbread men, and this is just like them just rolled into a ball. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. I like your lipstick on that. <laughs> 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 All right, wash that one down. Yeah, that I have to say that that is probably my favorite flavor. That one right there. I'd have to go back and watch all the episodes of the different things we've eaten. <laughs> I mean, that's... No, like, I can tell you right now, like, none of the ones stick out to me because I don't, you don't like, like cake the pops. texture of yeah. cake pops. That, right there, is the best one I've had. Really? But I also like the flavor. To me, the cake in a cup last month, mm -hmm. this one didn't quite hit, it. like, it was good. It didn't yeah. quite hit the high note of last week, or last okay. week, last month. It was good. It just didn't quite, to me, last month might have been the best... Right up there with like the breakfast in a cup thing. <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> All right. Uh, so next we have Christmas sugar cookies. This Christmas like sugar cookies. Plain old sugar cookies. Okay. The tea biscuits. Cheers. Whatever you want to call them. What Sabrina always likes about Ken, he's really good at not making things overly sugary. Yes. Dear God, I have no idea how you do that, Ken, but I love you for it. It's a freaking gift. Hmm. See, there's an, an option where I would have preferred, like, frosting on it. You probably like it more than me. Mm -hmm. That's not sugary enough for me. It's like a... It's not bad. It's just... It's hard to explain, but me, it's, like, it's like a tea biscuit. It's something that's not too sweet, but enough to go with something. Yeah. That'd probably be good with a cup of coffee. Mm-hmm. I guess. With sugar on it. That's what a tea <laughs> biscuit is for. I want to just get it wet. Maybe you dip that in your milk and then dip that in the bag of sugar <laughs> so the sugar will stick to it. I and like then, that. Hmm, not for me. All right, so finally, yeah, let's wash that one down. Mm -hmm. Oh, on a second. The very last thing that we'll ever try from Kentastic is the triple layer cookie bars. So it looks like. Well, just going off that, there's Oreo in there. So, triple layer. So, obviously, there's chocolate chip. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Oreo. And then that really looks like a brownie on top. So, it must be what the three layers are. Could be. Cocoa powder. So, that's This is a right totally there. you kind of brownie. Yeah, it totally is. Yeah. Sugar, sugar, and more sugar. <laughs> okay. Cheers. Here we go. Mmm. It's soft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going out in style, Ken. This, yeah. <laughs> I love how soft it is. I thought it was going to be more of a crunch. I can taste the Oreo, which I love. I love Oreos. Very sugary. Hmm. I'm moving it around <laughs> my mouth, and I can taste the different. I get a little bit of brownie, a little hint of Oreo, mm -hmm. a little bit of the chocolate chip. Yeah. That you know when you're at work and you just need that little pick-me-up around 2 o'clock because you're seriously hitting like that lull where you're like, I'm over this. I don't have enough in me to finish to 5. That's when you have one of these and you're like, huh, all the day is good. Man, that's I love good. everybody again. <laughs> I love the, the different, it's like a bag of cookies in my mouth. <laughs> That is good, but it's too too much for me. 
I'm all for the little tea biscuit. Maybe layer the tea biscuit on top of that. Then you have a quadruple <laughs> layer. <laughs> and you get your not sugary. To me, those have been good with frosting on them. But I like them like that. Mm, no. All right, so sad to say, for the last time, December yes. 2020, there it was. Ken Tassa Kates. Kates? I'm going to get his name wrong. <laughs> Taste of Home Cake Crate by Ken Tested Cakes. Uh, what did you think? Did you get this box? Let us know down in the comments. Don't forget to hit that like button and share with your friends. If you haven't done so already and you enjoyed this video and you want to see where we're going to head to next now that Ken's gone, <laughs> right? click right here to subscribe. Right over here is our last unboxing of Ken Tested Cakes. And on this side, you got our most recent episode. Stay safe and we'll catch you next time.